Good day great people and welcome to Angie 24 News. More breaking news unveiling in a moment for your watching pleasure.
when we start, after some years, no Nigerian will say, I'm from the West, East, North, but we'll be proud to say, he's a Nigerian. We want Nigerians to celebrate their nigerian -ness. Celebrate the apostles. We assure you, we are going to work hard to pull people out of poverty. We are going to work hard to ensure that our youth are employed. And the way to do it is that we will remove this country from consumption to production. People have said, people have said, how are we going to do it? This Lagos will remain the center of our finance, center of our excellence, center of our transshipment and everything. But we assure you, Nigeria has all the factor endowments to be a great country. Because we will ensure that there is rule of law and order. We will produce an enabling environment, the greater environment that will spur investment in our oil and gas. Nobody will steal our oil again. Our gas, our gas should be developed where it will give us more money than oil. And above this, all the cultivated land in the north which is our greater physical asset, we will invest in. We will ensure that we deal with the issue of agriculture as quickly as possible. As soon as we secure the country, farmers will go back to farm. We will support them to be more productive and we will use the food inflation to drive that inflation in this country. We will ensure that the world that we produce will lead to agricultural revolution, which will lead to export, and will earn more money, and our reserve will increase, and our rate of exchange will stabilize. What we are going to do is very easy. Let nobody tell you this country is a great country. When we do what we do, the youth will be employed. The youth will find jobs because we no longer allow people to be wealthy without enterprise. Everybody who has money here must be doing something. We will support the youth to start the MSMEs, the companies. Our promise will not be on TV. It will be physical. You will see it. It will be measurable. The enemies are not more formidable. I'm begging you, the youth, support what we are doing. This is the first time in Nigeria that the party chairman, presidential candidate, and vice presidential candidate will be people born after independence. This is the first time. You voted for uh, the broom that swept you into poverty. When they came into office, 55 people were, 55 million people were absolute poverty. Today they are 95. So it has worsened. You have voted for umbrella, it didn't work. You voted for broom, it didn't work. We now want you to vote for human beings. You go and vote for. Go and vote for. Go and vote for Mama, Papa. When you vote that, if you check it, APC chairman is 75 years. PDP chairman is 72 years. He was Shagari's minister 40 years ago. 
Our chairman is 52 years. 20 years different. If you check the age of three of us, the average age is 55. If you check the other one of PDP, it's over 70. The other one, we don't know their age. Thank you and God bless you. 